TC Eric here and today I'm going to show you how to go online with the Emule, the Dreamcast emulator. A lot of people have been pr having problems trying to connect online. That's probably because they're using the other network feature which is Kalira. Now of course people didn't know that there's two network features. One that allows you to op use OpenVPN which allows you to use the BBA internet connection on the Dreamcast emulator. The other one allows you to somewhat emulate network features to games that of course never had network features to begin with. So first we're going to want to get the emule the emulator which of course you can see the link at the bottom of the screen there. So we're going to go to the DEMUL website right here and the first one you're going to need which is 0. 582. This one allows you to use the BBA features. So you're just going to want to click on that there and of course the download should show up on the bottom of the screen or wherever you have your downloads going to download to. Now the next one we're going to go to is OpenVPN. Again the link is at the bottom of the screen. Both links will be available in the description below. Now you're just going to need the uh, 1003 version, the 1603 is a bundle and the only thing you need is the TAP um, connection usually TAP is used for emulation or um, uh, virtual operating system software so you're just gonna uh, depending on the if you have 32-bit or 64-bit select which one you need so um, that's about it there. You just want to open up the installation, install it, and I already have it installed, so I'm not going to go through all this that for you. Okay, so next up, we're going to go to the network folder, which all have features the TAP network. Now, the way you're going to uh, have this work is you're going to want to bridge your Ethernet and your local area connection. So hold the control button, that's right, the CTRL button on your keyboard and select Ethernet and then local area connection too. Next thing you're going to want to do is right click and bridge the connections. This of course will allow the local area connection to use the internet from your Ethernet connection. Okay, so as you can see now, the uh, bridge has now been created, and now all you're going to want to do is open up the DEMUL emulator, and yes, I'm picking up my Xbox 360 controller that uses the emulator. Alright, or the emulator uses the controller, whatever. Okay, so we're just going to run the Dreamcast here, and it's going to do this beautiful little intro as it usually does and now we're going to set up the BBA connection with the emulator. Now again the only way you're going to be able to use this in, in PSO, Fantasy Star Online, and Quake 3 Arena is you're going to have to use a web browser. This one right here is XDP Dreams, the limited edition which is available on a website, I can't give it to you because I don't know much about the licensing and copyright restrictions. So I'm going to let you do the searching yourself. But this is how you're going to set it up. So the, once you have this booted up here, all you're going to want to do is select the original user agent, which is the first one that pops up on the screen. Alright, so as soon as this pops up here, we're going to do the setup. Okay, so the, the next thing you're going to want to do is go to options up here. I guess I can move my mouse out of, out of the way there. We're going to go to Network Info, and we're going to select BBA, forward, 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 OK, OK, forward, OK, and save. That's about it. No numbers, nothing, just forward, 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 OK, save. Okay, so the next thing you're going to want to do is the left trigger again. Go to your bookmarks, because this is the easiest way to connect. Select the first link, press jump, 
and of course you're going to want to connect with your baud band adapter so press yes <clears throat> and okay so DHCP is adjusting and we are now connected to the internet on the Dreamcast emulator this of course you won't have to use the bridge connection but to set up the internet on your Dreamcast using the BBA adapter or the dial-up adapter you'll have to use the web browser and pretty much go through the same steps if not more but yes this is how you get on the internet and once you have it all set up you'll be able to play Quake 3 Arena Fantasy Star Online but for the emulator you're gonna have to use this uh, special discs that are hacked that will allow you to instantly connect to the hacked servers because if you do not know by now the Sega servers are now no longer available they have been cut okay so hopefully me and you will be able to play online if you follow this tutorial correctly it's pretty simple it's pretty easy everything you see on the screen this is how it's done if you need the BIOS files for your DMUL emulator you're gonna have to find that through Google I can't give you that again you know licensing and copyright uh, restrictions but hopefully you'll get set up and be playing with me in no time thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and I shall have another video ready for you uh, whenever thank you for watching goodbye